hey, I'm just going to make this quick video because I discovered a factory blocks the cold air intake in this car. This is a 2018 Cadillac ATS. And I was doing some research because I was wondering why I wasn't getting as much intake flow from the outside and I found something interesting. Well, here's where the turbocharger is on the two liter ATS. And this piece here, here's where the air, the air filter, here's the intake. Air filter goes here. This intake goes right here. Well, this piece block the inside. So no cool air is getting to the intake, which makes no sense. So I remove this piece and there was another piece like this that was blocking intake air also from the grill. And I took this piece off and I'm gonna show you. This is the grill right here. This piece, this piece blocked the grill air going to the intake. And this piece blocked it from going to the air box. So there was no real cold coming air into the vehicle except for like way down there. There was no direct intake. But now that I got this done, see, I removed those two pieces, this piece and this piece. And now watch this, I'm gonna shine it. Now check this out. Now I'm getting air. Now I'm getting air through the grill, see? Now I'm getting air through the grill. You see the light passing through? Light is passing through the grill. So now I'm getting direct air ramming to my air filter now. Now I'm sure it's like other Cadillacs as well. This is a 2018 Cadillac ATS with the two liter turbo intercooled engine. I'm sure it's also the same all the way back from 2013 Cadillac ATS where the factory blocked the intake air. And you pull this piece off, it's just held by these little plastic clips. You just pull it off. And this piece, you really gotta pull on it pretty good to get it to come out because it's got these little fingers right here. See all those little fingers? They stick in there pretty good. So you pretty much just gotta grab it and pull it. But after you get done, you got a nice free intake now. Free open intake. I'll shine air through here again, or shine, shine the light through here again, and you can see I'm getting direct air into my intake now. So therefore, I can fully benefit from my intake on my Cadillac. Because you spend all this money on a k and intake, and you're not even getting all the air you can get. And imagine the factory inlet hole that goes to the air box. You got these two places blocked off and you're breathing out of a tiny little straw kind of a air filter hole or air, air box hole. So yes, just little things make a big difference. And I just increased my airflow by a huge portion. And the faster I go, the grill will ram air into my filter box. So that's gonna be really good. All right, well, I hope you like this quick video. And I just wanted to show you guys this because I discovered this. Anyone that has a Cadillac ATS, you can really increase your air intake flow by just removing these two little pieces. You remove this piece first, because this is in front of this. Once you remove that piece, then you move this little piece, and that allows this area of the grill to breathe because this is covering the grill area to let air in. So you remove this piece and you got open air, open air from the grill to your filter box area. Here's the intake, how it sounds. It's all installed. The air here is sealed off by the hood. But we're now getting air
from the grill where we didn't get it before since I removed those two pieces. One kind of foam piece and one plastic piece that was blocking the air from this grill from getting to the air intake. Let's listen to how my intake sounds. Sounds real good. It's got a lot more intake air now since I removed those blocking items from the hood or from in front of the grill. I removed the restrictions in front of the grill so now I get direct air from the grill to the air filter. Thought I'd share that and hope you enjoy this and mad boosting.